In this Windows 7 tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how you can free up some space on your Windows 7 machine by uh, installing, making sure a certain update is installed, and, all, and then also running the disk cleanup utility, which will free up a lot of the uh, old uh, Windows update files that are no longer needed, and are actually could be taking up by many gigabytes of space on your uh, hard drive. So you want to make sure that you have this particular update installed. And then once you install that, you run disk cleanup, and that will uh, free up the space. So I'm going to actually install this update, and then I will show you what to do with disk cleanup in a second. Okay, first, if you want to check to see if you have that particular update installed, go to your control panel, start control panel. Then you go to Programs and Features, and click on View Installed Updates. And from here you can look for that particular update, which happens in here. Which is this one right here. Once you have the update installed, basically type cleanup in your search bar under your start menu and then click on disk cleanup and then let it check to see uh, what is available to be deleted, what can be cleaned up. And this might take a minute or two. And you also want to click on then clean up system files and then it'll basically restart. And that way it runs as administrator and we'll check for everything that could be deleted. So this time it's taking a little bit longer because it's actually checking the Windows Update cleanup, which is, should be the largest amount of space that could be freed up. And then you just go down this list and click on anything. It looks like it's taking up a lot of space. See system error memory dump here. On my systems over 700 megabytes. Have over six and a half gigs of temporary files. But here's one of the big ones. Also, Windows Update Cleanup. It's got to clean up 1.12 gigs. And let's go through and find the various large ones. So in my case, it's nearly 12 and a half gigs of space. And once you're ready, you click OK. It's going to ask you, are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? Click Delete. And then it's going to go through and delete all those files. And basically once it's done with this, uh, just restart your computer and that space will be freed up. So hopefully you found this tip useful. And if you did, uh, please click like below. Consider subscribing to my channel and also consider sharing this video on uh, sites like Google+, uh, Facebook, and Twitter. Okay, thank you.